Hello there, so welcome back to our channel. In this video, I'll be showing you on how to get iOS 17.4 emojis on Android, lower versions without using CFont application. Just like this. So keep on watching. So currently, I have here Oppo A83 model with Android 7 version. So this is an Oppo and this tutorial will work for Oppo or Realme phones. Now to start, let's check first my original emojis. So just a quick fun fact, this phone is already 6 years old as it was released last 2018. And I used this phone way back on my 7th grade. So here, let's check my original emojis. As you can see here, it's the very old emoji styles with these weird emoticons. So we will change that one to iOS style later on. And please excuse if the phone really has this very lucky feature because it's already 6 years old and the storage is very, very tight. So to start, check first the link on description and you need to download all these files given in the description. Just copy the link and paste it on your browser. So here are the needed files you need to download. First, install this iMod Pro application. So here it was successfully installed. Now go to your home screen and as you can see here, we've already install the iMod Pro. This time open your theme store. Go to me option. Go to your profile. Go to that settings button. And then as you can see here, our version number, it's already a higher version, so we need to downgrade the theme store version first. Go to your settings. Go to app management. And then go to theme store app. So here, let's click on T and select theme store. So you should see there an uninstall updates and click uninstall updates. We need to downgrade the theme store to 6.4.3 version as it is the required version for the iMod Pro modification. So here it says uninstall finished. As you can see our version is now on 6.4.3. Now let's open iMod Pro. Now swipe right or click that three line button. Go to my patch list. So here, click that one and select these. Click import patches. Now go to the downloads folder and then select import patches zip. Then click import. So that was our patch list. And this time, go to your downloads folder again. Go to your downloaded files and long press this iOS 17 TTF file. Select patch and select a font file that you would want to patch the iOS emojis with. So here I chose a Furious Hello font. So remember your choice because we will use it later on the theme store app. Now click on the theme store. Click OK. And this time, search for the font you patched the iOS emojis with. So I chose earlier the Furious Hello, and then we will search for the Furious Hello now. So here's the font, click on that font, and then download. Make sure to go back to the Theme Store Home 
just before the font gets automatically applied. Now go to your sources, click on font, and then apply the Furious Hello font. So it was already successfully applied and this time let's check our emojis. So here as you can see we already have the iOS emojis on our keyboard. And just for your information my default keyboard is the touch ball keyboard I am using right now. And as you may notice there are no new emojis on this keyboard so we still have to install a Google keyboard to get the latest versions of the iOS emojis. So as you can see here, install and then set up Google keyboard as your default keyboard. Now select input method and select Google keyboard. This time let's check our emojis again. So here we have the Google keyboard and we already have the new iOS emojis with iOS 17.4 newest emojis. You may now send new iOS emojis on your messenger application, Instagram, and other social media accounts. So that's it for this video. Be sure to subscribe.